All right, guys, Taff here again. Um, I moved on from the trike. I'm making a quad now. Um, or I, again, I'm using some uh, electrical conduit pipe and uh, making a four-wheeled uh, quad. And uh, what I've done is I, I, I bent the shape with my frame, or my frame. And um, I, bought, I bought some wheelies. These are the 16 half inch or 42. Uh, CM, I think I call it. They're the big ones. Uh, I threw one of these the other day and it was awesome. That's why I got the, these wheels. It's fantastic. This is my motor on the back. And uh, as you can see, I can lift it straight off like this. That's like, there's my frame I'm building. Um, I've actually made, I've actually made the, uh, adapter there or, or the frame to fit my uh, bottom of my motor in the back of it and it fits straight in. I've got four clips that goes in. I've also got these here. I bought one inch fiberglass rod. It comes in the 10 foot length. It's about 70 bucks I think. I got it online from Granger's. But that's it there. It comes in 10 foot length and I've, I've already mounted those there. And that's that's all going. I went to the scrap scrap yard and I picked up a, a car seat belt that I'm gonna use. I'm gonna get a seat for it, or I might make one yet. This is it. This is just a, for me to get my measurements. And of course, I'm gonna clean it all up after. And right now, I'm welding the steering part of it for the front. That's where I am right now. So I'm doing that, and then uh, put it all together, clean it all up, and see uh, what I need next. My chute is over here. It's a it's a 28 square foot, uh, 28 square meter, and uh, a couple of props. One got dinged up, of course. But uh, other than that, it's 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 looking good, and I should I'll be done today probably. So uh, hopefully it's gonna fly. I'll check it out. Anyway, here's an update of how far I got so far. Got two front wheels done, and I'm drilling. Uh, third wheel so far, and uh, I put a pin through it. Take it up. That one's done. The wheel's on and I've done the same thing. I cut the little collars and I put a split pin through it, bend it over, so the wheel can't come off. If I want to detach the whole wheel from the cog, I can do this. And uh, it's going to be the same on the front. I did the same on the front. We're going to take a quick look at that. There. Um, I'll zoom in. Did the same thing there. I drilled those. And uh, that's done. And that's the other one over there. Okay, so I've got one more to do. And then I'm gonna look at the seat belt and a seat. So that's the next part of all this. And I'll update you on that. But all this stuff I, uh, I got from the local hardware store, uh, except for the fiberglass one inch and the wheels. Okay, um, if this actually does good and I can fly it, I'm gonna get some uh, uh, chrome molly pipe and I'll redo it all again in the, in the proper material and see how it goes but it's gonna fly awesome I know